The controversies surrounding oil prospecting license 245 continued at the Federal High Court as none of the defendants in the two suits filed by the federal government over the oil license showed up in court. The prosecutor sought clarification from the court on whether to make an oral application or come by way of a motion and notice to demand the arrest of the immediate past Attorney General and Minister of Justice, Mr. Mohamed Adoke. I would like to request for a warrant of arrest of the first defendant. I will appreciate if my Lord will guide me because I actually want to make an application for a warrant of arrest. I also want the court to guide me on whether I can do that orally or come by the way of a motion, the lawyer told the court. Mr. Giovanni also told the court that if the order seeking to arrest Mr. Adoke is granted, it will become easier for the security agency to liaise with the international police to initiate an extradition move. However, Justice Soho asked the prosecutor to apply formally to the court, saying that such an application cannot be made orally. The judge said that if Mr. Adoke was already arraigned before the court and was attempting to escape, it would have been proper to issue such a warrant. But in the instant case, the defendant has not been arraigned before the court. As such, the order is not necessary. One of the cases, the first charge, the first defendant, the former Attorney General, is not within jurisdiction for us to serve him. Even having taken a date today, we will serve those that are available. And we will need to even amend the charge to take the trial further if we can't get others. We have mentioned it already. We have taken a date. We need to amend and bring those who are available. We we'll serve them and then bring them to trial while we go look for the rest. The EFCC had in December 2016 charged nine suspects, including the former Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Mr. Mohamed Adoke, for allegedly transferring illegally more than 800 million US dollars purportedly meant for the purchase of the oil prospecting license 245 to Mr. Don Etete, a former oil minister and Malibu Oil. Amaka Okafo, Channel Television News.